Hey, Canistraro, tell me how a 3D model helps create prefabricated pipe. 3D models help us visualize pipe through any building or space, such as a mechanical room. The first thing we try to do is to work with all MEP trades to generate a complete model. It allows the project team to work together to vet out any issues prior to install. The model helps the coordinator communicate with the foreman to understand the building itself and what's happening within that space. The next step is we take that entire model and break it down into smaller module assemblies. We indicate what components make up each uh, spool, such as elbows, pipe, weights of pipe. We dimension any specific items. Then these spools are provided along with the material stock list to the fab shop where we start the fabrication process. All right, so what we do, Vinny, after you give us the fab sheets, is we'll separate these all by sizes. They'll load up the cutting table. They'll cut them all by size. They'll tag them what you have for your notation here and with the job they're going to. And then in turn, they'll go on cots. They'll get dispersed out to all of the welders. You give them to us all, you, get, you set them all up by uh, areas. Area one for high piping, area two for low piping. That's how they'll all get loaded out on the trucks. You can see some of these fabrications that we have here. Those will all get ready to go onto a cart and get over into the loading bay onto a tractor trailer. The level of detail within a model allows us to have the confidence to know that if we can build it digitally, then we can build it physically. The more detail we put, the smoother and more efficient we are when installing in the field. 